I'm be honest with you guys, man. The thing that spirit is telling me today, and the thing that spirit is telling me to stress today that I woke up on my mind is people are born with raw natural talent. Like, for example, my mom and dad could draw. My brother could play sport, could play basketball or football or sports. And me, I was born to be a spiritualist. Everybody has a natural raw talent. It's something they can do. Some people can sing. Some people can draw. Some people can play sports. Some people can are good with ta- are good with taxes and numbers. Some people have an eye for different things. But my thing is, find out what your talent is, even if you have to ask God. And then once you find out what your talent is, go through your process to master your talent. I don't know what your process is to master your talent, but whatever the process is to master your talent, go through it and master your talent or talents, because I believe I have multiple talents, but master your multiple talents, then use those very talents to take care of your family. I don't understand why the world doesn't, why the world isn't like me. Everybody asks what their talents are, and then they go master their very talent that God gave them instead of trying to force themselves to do jobs that they know they hate. Why don't you fight through and do the job you know you're meant to do and that you know you're meant to love? No matter what it is, everybody has a talent in something, even if it isn't something that most people would be confident in doing or confident in showing people. God needs talent from everybody in the world, no matter how small you may think it is in your head or how much you may think it doesn't overall matter. Believe me, it matters. Everybody is needed for something. Everybody can do something that nobody else can do. You just have to be brave enough to find out what it is and serve your purpose. And that's what I'm doing through spirituality and multiple other talents that I think I will develop into. I can't say what they are right now, but I have multiple talents in multiple different areas, and I'm looking to exploit all of them to fulfill my true destiny and live my true life that I was always supposed to live and be able to take care of the people that I'm meant to take care of in this lifetime. And I learned that through... The things I went through in my life, it showed me how tough I am. It showed me how resilient I can be and how much I have to believe in myself and believe in my natural born gift. And y'all see what's starting to happen for me because I believe and I did. The most important spiritual work of my life, and now I'm to the point where I feel like I've mastered my talent. I've started to capture some of my blessing, but now I have to defend it and make sure that the Lord knows that everything I've been working for, I want it because I'm going to defend it and make sure I keep it and make sure it continues to grow because I continue to nurture it, water it, and take care of it and continue to grow with it as it continues to push me to develop as a human being and as a as a person and just continues to become a person that the world can be proud of, in my personal opinion. But that's just my thoughts on how everybody has a unique talent that nobody else has. Everybody has raw talent. You just have to hunt it and find it within yourself. And once you find it, you have to learn how to hone it and get the most out of it. And once you learn how to hone hone it and uh, hone it and own it, you can use it to change your life forever, in my personal opinion. But that's what I woke up with on my mind, and that's what I wanted to share with you guys, man. Just find your raw talent, hone it and own it, and you can use it to change your life. 
because that's basically what I'm doing. I found my raw talent. I used it till I mastered it, and then I was able to use it to help change the world, starting little bit by little bit. But you have to be brave enough to ask the question and then do the work. Then once you do that, you will slowly start seeing the success come in. But before you have the success, you have to defend it to be able to show God that this is the life you want. That is the tough part. Are you ready to do the process to chase your success down, master your success, and then defend the success you have? I know I am. What are you is my question and my opinion. But that's just my opinion, though.